Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So this is going to be a big summer children's clothing haul. I have three kids and they have shut up and I haven't really bought them that much with everything that's gone on in the last year and I did a huge clear out of the wardrobe recently and this is what I've picked up. So it's all from Next. So if you want to see what I bought basically then keep watching. So for anyone that's new to my channel, hello, I'm Charlotte, I'm 33, mum to three, and I have Bill who is going to be nine in June, I've got Daisy who's going to be five tomorrow, and I've got Stan who's recently turned three, and as I mentioned in the intro, they have all really shot up recently, um, obviously with the restrictions and the lockdowns and everything in the past year, I didn't really buy them too much, I kind of bought enough to you know, get by and stretch it. We weren't going anywhere, it was mainly the garden. Um, and we reused a lot of things from the year previously. So when things started warming up a little bit recently, I went through the wardrobes like, I'm sure they had some stuff last year that they could reuse. And it was all like the size below. Um, in some cases, even the size below below. Um, and we went through all the wardrobes, we cleared out. I sent a huge bag of stuff to one of my friends for her little girl. I've put away all of Bill's stuff for Stan. And then Stan's stuff we sent to a clothes bank, which leads us to here and now. So I made a big order. Normally, a lot of the time, I will buy things from H&M because they're really affordable and um, I can get what I need quite easily. But the issue is at the moment is that when I made this order, excuse my next door neighbour's dog, he's very barky. Um, when I made this order, the shops were all still closed here in like England and um, a lot of the sizes that I needed just weren't in stock and I couldn't really find a lot of what I needed. So I tried Next instead. Next can sometimes be a little bit pricier, but I feel like if you do shop smart with Next, you can get a few nice things. Um, so I have three big piles of clothes here in front of me and I will run through them. I will go with Daisy first. First. So if you've got a girly, then I'll do all the girly stuff first. And then if you've, you've not got girls and you don't want to watch the boy stuff, you can click off then. Um, so the first thing that Daisy really needed were some sandals. She wears sandals a lot during the summer because she generally wears dresses quite a lot. If Daisy can wear a dress and it's warm enough to get her legs out and wear a nice pretty dress or a skirt or something like that, that is what she loves to do. And obviously with like non-uniform days and stuff at school, I wanted her to have a few bits that would make her feel special. So I picked up these sandals um the reason why i went for these is that daisy has quite narrow feet like i do and it can be quite difficult to find shoes that fit well i find unless you go to places like clark's but i find the narrower the foot the worse the options are for like children's shoes there's less options available they don't always carry every range in a narrow size so what i tend to look for are shoes where i can adjust how tight they are both at the front and around the ankle so these have velcro <laughs> I do them they have velcro at the front so i can make them as tight as i need to and they also have velcro on the ankle and what's nice about those as well is that she can adjust them they were 17 pounds which i thought was actually a really decent price because they are so well made and so sturdy and they're like this kind of frosted sparkly gold shade we've had barking dogs and now you've got my washing machine going crazy can you hear that in the background you might just be able to hear it i can but those are the first thing that i picked up for here and i think she's going to love them and they're really comfy and soft as well but that's those then this is actually a birthday present for her birthday tomorrow and i had to get it and you'll see why in a second so if you knew my daughter is called daisy and this is a beautiful linen style dress i really hope it shows the quality on camera because it's stunning it has little frilly shoulders but they're substantial enough to kind of add a bit of warmth if, if it gets cooler and then it's buttoned up all the way down and then there are these little beautiful like embroidered daisies on and oh i saw it and i just thought I have to get that for her. Uh, that was £17, so again, probably more on the expensive side. But um, this is in five years, and she's quite petite. 
uh, generally speaking. So I feel like she'll wear this this year and next year, which is a nice thing with Daisy sometimes because she can get a lot of use out of them. And I just, that's a birthday present. So I'm gonna pop that for like to one side to wrap tonight for tomorrow, which is crazy. I can't believe she's gonna be five. Next up is another dress and this one was slightly cheaper at £11 but it's a very similar design actually um, and this I just thought this was gorgeous you know like with like pigtails and a new sandals or something and like um, a straw hat something like that um, it's really sweet it's like a little pink gingham dress and what's really nice about it is that I have a pink gingham dress and um, we can wear them together um, so this is from the next generation range and it's pure organic cotton so for £11 for a five-year-old dress I think that's quite decent considering it's organic cotton but it's got wooden buttons on similar kind of shape to it and it will come down I would say to about mid calf um, and she will she'll be obsessed with that one she's not seen some of these yet so um, she'll be really really happy um, this is another from the next generation again really really lovely quality the one thing i will say about next is that while they are a little bit like they're not even expensive they're just not like on the cheaper side if you know what i mean this was eight pounds but the quality is fab and they always wash really well i find and this is again the organic cotton but i just loved this it's a really easy chuck on kind of t-shirt dress um it comes out slightly in the skirt like an a-line skirt but i think she'll love this again and it's just one where you can chuck it on with your sandals and go and play with your brothers in the garden or you know climb around at the park and nice and comfortable and then the next thing that i got which she has tried these on and these are quite big on her so i feel like she'll probably fit these better towards the end of the summer and also next year um these are like belted paper bag style shorts so they do fit it they're just slightly looser on her than perhaps like they would be on like the child model if that makes sense but you tie them and um that means like i can at least like tie them nicely around it and they've got an elasticated waist so they're easy to get on and they have little pockets in the bottom and i just thought again these are really practical you know like if she is like running around and climbing and whatever sometimes shorts are just the best way to go so i picked those up and then i also got she's got a few cardigans and t-shirts that still fit so i didn't pick any more t-shirts up for daisy but i definitely did for the boys but i did get this little cardigan which is a little bubbled one and this is just so cute but i feel like it will go with everything and because she likes to wear pink anyway it's not like she's going to stop wearing this once summer's over she'll wear it into autumn as well with like jeans and stuff and a t-shirt underneath um but i just really like this they had a few different colors and um it's really nice quality again so she loves that and she has seen that one and then this was the first thing that i added to my basket when i actually went to go and do the order because i saw it and i just thought oh my gosh this is daisy all over and it is this pretty rainbow dress so it has super long frilly sleeves which are nice and elasticated and then it has a little cut out detail on the back so there's some little buttons here and a cut out bit there and it's just a pastel rainbow dress and i know the next time she has a non-uniform she's going to be like i want to wear my rainbow dress i know she will um so this is just gorgeous that's one thing i've got to say like next always come out with some really like different stuff that's if you've got a girly girl they're right up daisy street and then finally this she's already worn and it's been washed a couple of times and it's exactly the same as when i got it which is great um but this is a tie-dye zip up hoodie um just for you know if she's wearing her shorts and she gets a bit cold she can chuck this on she loves this and bill actually has a matching tie-dye uh, hoodie that i'll show you in a sec um but yeah this is it's just lovely it's got pockets washes really nicely and it's just a bit funky i've noticed that tie dyes in a lot with like a lot of kids clothing at the moment so she loves that and then now i will go on to bill next so with him it was mainly he needed the staples like hoodies and stuff i bought him a few like last year and um, so they obviously still fit but a lot of t-shirts and shorts like he's really tall so once he has a growth spurt things look ridiculous on him they look absolutely ridiculous so the first thing that i got was this set and this is very trendy i find um it was 18 pounds but it's a t-shirt and short set and he's getting 
he's coming up to nine so the clothes that he wears are a lot less charactery you know he wants things that are like cool do you know what I mean I find that quite hard because I'm 33 and I'm mum of three and I don't think I am cool so it's like when I'm on the website I'm like oh I don't know what to pick and then I ask him and he doesn't know either so I've tried my best but this is it's like a khaki t-shirt and I really liked the detailing on it. I think it is quite it's quite cool, isn't it? It's funky, a bit funky. The fact that I said funky probably makes it not cool at all. Um, it has, it says unlimited on the front of it. And I just like the cutout and that kind of thing. And then it has matching khaki shorts, which again, these can be worn together or separately. Um, and I just quite like the fact that it was like easy to wear because he's one of those kids that like, if I tell him to go and get dressed, he will literally pull anything out of his wardrobe and it doesn't matter what it looks like. Um, but sometimes those combinations are interesting <laughs> to say the least. So he likes things that come in sets because he needs like to put them together. He's just not bothered. He just wants to go out and play. Like he doesn't care what he's wearing. Good on him, I say really. The next thing that I got were a pack of two short jean jean shorts jean shorts these were two for 20 pounds which again i think is really good value for 10 pounds each um and again these are always fab quality they've got a nice like stretch to them but what i like because i have a tall but slender child the they still have the adjustable waist which i i've always needed with bill from like the minute he started wearing jeans you know when they move out of sleep suits i've always needed like that adjustable waist these come in like a midwash and like a proper true blue denim and um they will just get worn constantly because he's always in like shorts the minute like it's slightly increases in temperature my boy is in shorts and won't wear anything else until it starts snowing again basically and then as i mentioned he mainly needed t-shirts um so i got him a like well these are really good quality and really cheap these were three pound fifty each but they're like proper you know like really good quality thick cotton and i got him in yellow because he's a blondie with blue eyes and really suits yellow i just had to wait for my washing machine to stop hammering away again it's got towels in it so you know it's a really heavy load and it's really loud when it spins that um i also got him in mint green again three pound fifty and brilliant quality i'm really pleased with these you can probably tell and then finally i got him a pink because i think he looks really nice in it like it's like a kind of like a movie pink do you know what i mean like a little touch of purpley in it so that is him and then finally this is his hoodie which is tie-dye bright blue and he loves this um the minute this is in the wash he's like you can see him looking for when it's going to be ready again so that is his um and it's got a pouch and stuff again this is washed really well not lost any color and um hasn't like dyed anything in the wash either which is always a plus so picked him up that it's going to be one of those videos today <laughs> i just have to let the dog in we playing knock and run that's his new game he'll like cry at the door i'll go and let it in and he'll run away to the back of the garden and look like he's laughing at me he genuinely looks like he's laughing and it drives me mental um but yeah that is all we've got bill so far and um, i've ordered him some hiking boots from decathlon which is a weird purchase but he does cubs and they go on like a lot of walks and adventures and that kind of thing so they are coming um at some point and i haven't ordered him any um sandals yet because to be honest i buy them for him every year and he rarely wears them unless we go on holiday and we're not going on holiday this year um so i might just buy him some new trainers when he runs out of the ones that he's got he's got a pair of trainers and he usually batters them um so i'll ask him if he wants some i'll obviously pick him some up but he's quite he's quite an active kid like he wants to get out and about and we let him play with his friends on our road now and they like just play like i don't know hide and seek and football on the end of the road where it's quiet and whatever and um sandals aren't really like the one are they so yeah anyway um and then finally auntie stan who is my youngest he's three and he is the one that needed the most because i must have just been squishing him into anything for the past year because everything <laughs> was like he's three and he had like 18 month t-shirts and 18 month shorts and i don't uh honestly i tried on quite a few bits on him to see what actually fit and some of it just looked like i was putting my child in hot pants um so where should i start i'll start with these um these are his little um shoes we get these we probably bought these 
every year since he's been able to walk from next and they are just fantastic they're like a faux suede leather type effect they've got a really comfortable footbed and they last so well and again like daisies you can adjust them at the toe and around the ankle um, I really recommend these if you see them on the website because they're fab and we do buy them every year and then and then for Stan, it's mainly like t-shirts and shorts and that kind of thing. So the first t-shirt I picked up, because he is entering into that, like, I really like superheroes and characters and that kind of thing. So um, I've tried to pick him up a few t-shirts that, like, make him smile, but are also, like, quite cute as well. So this is a Mickey Mouse one, which is a lilac colour. And I love the little face. I think it's really cute. And then on the back, it just says Mickey Mouse, like, down the back of it. Um, and this is quite... It comes up quite large, three to four. Um, he's obviously only just turned three. So I feel like he'll probably get a good wear out of this. You can tell I stretch clothes out for as long as possible, can't you? But... It'll probably last him a good year, I imagine, if not longer. And then I also picked up some of the cheaper ones again. These were £3, but it's the same range as Bill's, but I think it was slightly less in price because, obviously, he's a little bit smaller. So I've got the lilac um, shade for him as well. And then I think I also, yes, I did. I picked up a baby blue as well. Um, so from the same range for three pounds. It's a really pretty like cornflower blue actually. Um, so he does have a few t-shirts still like a grey one and a white one and a stripy one and a black one I think. So I wanted to add some colour in. Um, especially for like you know like nursery or like quick changes because three-year-olds still get messy um then the rest of it is like i've got some shorts i've got a two-piece set and a hoodie so the shorts i had to get some comfy ones bill has some like this already and i got stan like a pair that are very similar for five pounds and these are drawstring on the waist they're really like comfy and i can like make sure they fit in properly and they have a little pocket on the back but they're really really soft and i really like the upturned like leg here really cute um so again these will go really nicely together and yeah I'm re these are really like affordable his age group um i got him a pair of shorts these were nine pounds i was going to get a pack of two like bill but they didn't have his size they just got these but again these are adjustable waist and stan does quite like being comfy so he'll probably prefer wearing like the cotton one sometimes i think um but they have like the little turned up leg as well and um he has a pair that he's wearing at the moment that are two to three but they do look quite snug he's gone into nursery wearing them today um and uh, I'll probably keep him in those until like they look really ridiculous and then we'll start wearing these ones more I think and then I got oh this I think is me trying to cling on to the fact that next year there is no way that he will wear things like this because these are quite these like dungarees make me think of little children but they're like the are they these like see sucker is it is that what it is it's like a really really fine stripe they're like a linen blend and they have like um copper detailing on here but like with a little t-shirt and his sandals are gonna look so cute and um, they have a little pocket at the front and again these what i like about dungarees is that they last quite well because you can tighten these when they're a little bit too long on them and then loosen them out as they get older so again you can get a few like years worth out of them well a couple of years anyway and then and this little set uh, I loved, I shared this on Instagram on my stories recently and I had quite a few people asking where it's from and um, so it has been in the wash, sorry about that, I've not ironed it but again it's tie-dye and it's this top so it's like a lovely muted like mint green shade and grey and then it has matching shorts and they are so cute on him and again i like that you can wear them together or separately um but he loves these and he also got a captain america uh hat uh, like a cap uh, but he's taking that in to like preschool nursery with him today because obviously it's sunny um so that was also from next i'll try and leave like a little picture of him wearing them because he was super cute in them and then the final thing that i bought just to keep him nice and warm and because i thought he would love it is this little dinosaur jacket um so again feel like it comes up really big um but this was 16 pounds and i'm aware that i'm paying for this and this 
but he just thought it was really cute and um, it's striped on the inside and really 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 soft actually um, and that is oh it has spikes down the bottom as well I forgot about that but he will love that and that is essentially everything that I picked up so I don't think they'll need much more the one thing that they may well need are like swimming costumes just for like swimming lessons I don't obviously we're not going on holiday so I don't think I would spend like loads of money on that um and Mark and I have got a day off next week that we, while the kids are at school, that we're both having off together, so no work. And um, I think we might actually go to Primark because he really wants to get a few things for him. And um, I will never say no at uh, those around Primark. So I might have a look there and see if there are any like swimming cozies or anything that just jumps out at me for the kids. Uh, but this should do them really nicely. And um, I'm really happy with what I picked up actually. It's been ages since I've done like a proper shop for their like clothes and stuff. And um, it should last them well, particularly because Stan can wear all of Bill's stuff when he's this age. So yeah, anyway, but I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope you have sunshine where you are today. We do. I've not really been out and enjoyed it yet I've just been working and filming as much as I can today and trying to catch up after Easter but um yeah thank you so much for watching have a lovely rest of your day whatever you're up to and I will hopefully see you all very very soon Bye.